the name for your uh, business, um, uh, the coincidence of your last names with the business name, can you kind of... When Randy and I formed the partnership, we had to come up with a name and we thought and thought and thought and my wife finally said, Angler Beaver, we both spelled our names wrong, which everybody tells us that we spelled it wrong, but that's how we came up with it. And is that, um, is, and you pronounce them the same way as the... I pronounce mine beaver like the animal, yeah. and he pronounces his angler, but we change it to angler. Oh, okay. That's <laughs> such a coincidence. Yeah. Yeah. And, um, and so what, what sorts of uh, animals and mounts do you, do you all work on? We will mount any non-domestic animal um, from mammals to fish to reptiles, um, birds. Um, and so what, I guess, is the most common, um, you know, uh, commission that you'll receive or? We do a lot of ducks and pheasants, mostly ducks. Um, we do our fair share of deer, but, and other small mammals, but our biggest um, mm. animal right now are birds. Yeah. Um, and I guess, what, what is, um, you know, the, uh, I guess, uh, most uh, challenging um, mount that you've ever worked on? I guess. Probably our birds yeah. with the thin skin. Yeah. And, um, and, uh, and I think uh, people may be curious, like, what, like, uh, in terms of, um, you know, an exotic mount that you've done, um, is there anything that you, uh, you've worked on related to? The most exotic I'm going to say is a bearded dragon, um, but we've done African mounts, um, mounts from Alaska. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. but probably that bearded dragon is the most exotic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's a is that a lizard? It's a lizard. Yeah. Um, and uh, I guess you know what do you like about the profession? I like the artistic aspect of it, to try to make the animal look like a live animal again. Mm -hmm. How do you do that? Like, are there techniques or? A lot of different techniques. Um, we sculpt a lot of our, well, all the deer get, we sculpt the eyes in the deer. Um, mm -hmm. You can put expression in them by making their eyes turn different directions, make their ears turn different directions. Um, mm -hmm. And then we, Every animal gets some paint on it to some degree. 